remember her name? No, Carol. Uh, Carol. Is it Carol? Yeah. I thought I so. so. I hope so. She's left that um, cigarette butt. Cigarette. At the front, yeah. The pronunciation, cigarette butt. But. But. Can. Can. Outside. Mm -hmm. Are we supposed to bring it in? Uh, I think only at the end of the day. No, no, no. That one stays outside all the time. Okay, because the one that she showed us today is outside. Yep. Do mm -hmm. we need to bring it in? The, the one that is out there is always outside. Oh, Nobody right. brings so, it in. So this one will stay here, right? I guess. It's right next to the door. That's what they want. Really? I mean, I was surprised when she said that. Okay. Okay, you know what? I'm going to take a picture of it and I'm going to send it to Janet. <laughs> so she has the heads up. Mm hmm Okay? Mm hmm Because if, if Carol didn't say anything about bringing it in, no. how are you supposed to know? Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> okay, you know what? Just to be on the safe side. You know? Yeah. We've noticed that. We've talked about it. Yeah. And, and mm -hmm. we Janet about yeah. it. Okay? It's right next to the door. That you don't know the people to be smoking over there, right? They will be. I, I, I wouldn't. Because she said. She said. She didn't. Doesn't she know school rules? <laughs> okay. Just in case. I'm going to take a picture uh, so Janet's ready. And ask right? her, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, thanks. Fun and games. The church lady. I think her name is Carol. Gosha seems to think so too. I'm not sure. Where'd my veggies go? There you go. You're leaning on my veggies. I thought, just because I'm bringing pizza doesn't mean my veggies have to suffer. Or I have to suffer. Almost all the handles and pulls are on all the cupboards. The front door was wide open. I didn't think that was a good idea. I closed it. This morning, there was no receptionist to open things up, so I had to open it. This was lunch yesterday, right? Mimi and I went to get the tree visitor and then picked up our pizza on the way home. It was still really good. Now I'm just waiting for Danielle to show up. For our class. Yeah, the language she used <laughs> was a little unusual last week. I guess she felt strongly. You really shouldn't have to take care of kids that aren't your own. I'm sure some people are great at it. Some people aren't. It's 
Some people just aren't. Spinach, tomatoes, and chicken. That's my favorite three toppings if I have three toppings choice. You can't hear what's going on in my head, I'm thinking. Don't you hate that when people stop talking? And then don't let you in on the big secret? Mm. I'm stuck in my cotton cooler. There's a little bit of blue sky, but lots of clouds. That's two days that Janet's had to do registration or whatever, office duties. I guess when an office person is sick, there's no one to supply. Uh -huh. I don't realize that. Don't they have a? Oh, as as um, Secret said this morning, don't they have supplies to call on? Like when we're sick, supply secretaries. Oh, doesn't look like it. So, not this weekend, but next weekend is Thanksgiving. So that's something to look forward to. We have a staff meeting tomorrow morning. No, afternoon. No, 
before lunch. Yeah, I'm sure, before lunch. 11.50. Gosha's name is Malgorzata. So she goes by Gosha. Not Polish, she's not sure. Anyway, oh. here we go. So I have my applesauce. There you are. I was thinking to myself, you should be here soon. Yeah. I actually put your uh, your attendance on your seat downstairs. Oh, you. I appreciate that. Yeah, because uh, there's no uh, no Hilda here today. Okay. So. Sounds good. I hope nobody take it. like um, Downton Abbey are so nice and mild. I like mild British comedies. Obviously, so does Mimi. I've never seen one, she's watched them all. Maybe I'll go walking today. Not too bad. How was yours? Good. I think that was good. Yeah? I was like, oh yeah. Remember I was talking to you, I was like, oh, I took a home and like clean the house and toys. <laughs> but my crazy came home earlier. So I wasn't sure what time he was coming home. And I'm like, so he came home and I'm like, we're just scrambling. And he's like, okay, can you shoot you? <laughs> what time are they coming? He's like, I don't know. <laughs> and we're, like, we're just like all like halfway through cleaning and this guy showed up. <laughs> Well, you've well, both you've both been at work. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. They're they're totally understanding people, but I've always been raised like. Yeah, me too. If, if, yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's just what you do. Nice to start to teach her boyfriend too. I'm like, when company comes, you clean. Of course. That was good. My poor kitty's so a little stressed because there's like extra people in the house, yeah. and sometimes like they get scared when they like the kids don't chase them. Sometimes they run, they scare the cat. Yeah. So they were a little mad at us, so they both peed on our clothes. Oh, jeez. Yeah. Your cats. I'm glad my cats have settled down. <laughs> I don't know. Like, I don't get it. Uh-uh. I thought, like, so I was telling Scott, I'm like, oh, maybe they're scared of you. And cats fine with them, and then they peed on my clothes. That's horrible. I remember a cat that used to. And it was the girl that did it. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> that smells awful. Mm -hmm. I use baking soda and vinegar to get it out. Hello, hello. Happy Monday. Happy Monday. Greetings. Hey. How's it It's good. How are you guys? I don't know. Okay. Surviving. You're surviving? Yep. Mm. How are you? I'm good. Good. For a Monday? <laughs> yeah. 
We were all feeling a little slow this morning. Yeah. Yeah. Boy, was Janet here? She was here compensating for no, no yeah. Hilda. Yeah. But then she had to leave. So she's gone. Yeah. Oh, I think the, the office is locked. <laughs> Good. Good question, because I don't have that key. Oh, yeah, we don't have that key. And it is definitely open, because yeah. it was open, wide open, but I closed it. Okay. Uh, that's why you were able to, but you have a key. Okay, I good. I have a key just good. for the office. I don't have a key for the office. Ah, so we, we, someone has to lock up then. It must be Janet who will have to lock up, because. I'll uh, email her. You know what? I mean, I suppose I can't, I can't have all the keys. I should, I'm the person who's always here first. And I'm the peer person who's always here last. Why don't I have a key? Yeah. Uh, I mean, I don't really want the keys because it sounds like it's a major hassle of a door, but. Yeah. Well, if you want a key, ask Janet. Yeah. If you wanna... Because it's, it would be a, less of a problem for her, mm -hmm. at least just for closing the entire building, not for the, I mean, I can't do the office, but. Like I guess when Hilda, when she leaves, she would lock that. She locks, key, right? yes. Mm -hmm. okay. So it's only in the... It gets locked at one. But the thing is, if somebody leaves that way, they, it, they can still get out. Yep. They can get out. They can get out. And then it's unlocked? And it's, well, then it's, if it just closes behind them, it's never locked. Because it never slams enough to lock. Uh, okay. so, so we it's... always have to check because it's always open if it, if it wasn't Hilda who closed it. Mm -hmm. So we really have to keep a, an eye on people. We, you know what? When Hilda leaves, she should close the gate. I don't know if that'll stop people, but just to say, do not the gate that's at the top of the stairs. Because that's a pain to have people coming, leaving that way and us having to check the, well, of course, we still have to check the door even. Yeah, I suppose that's why we just have to check the door. I think so. Yeah. And that leads you, this is not another, another quiet walk prayers to uh, right yeah that once you get that dust of prayers at 145 mm -hmm. a couple minutes right so yeah maybe if you know you're the last one leaving we have to we yeah. have to check it every day and I are pulling it right well pushing it to see pushing. if it's open mm -hmm. yeah if you're on the outside you pull it but mm -hmm. yeah. yeah you have to push it from the inside from no the inside. And then how do you if they want to get out they have to turn if it's properly locked, you can't open it from the inside without turning, without turning it. And then once they've turned it, then it's open. And it's open because they don't push it shut. They leave. They just leave and let it slam, right? Well, it doesn't slam enough to lock. Okay, so you don't need a key to lock it from the inside. Is that right? If it's locked. Yes, you do because it doesn't, it isn't locked. Okay. Oh, you do. No, you don't. If it, yeah, no, it has to, you have to, yeah, it's a padlock. Yeah. It's either locked or open. Okay, I'm not sure what I should tell Janet about all that. Give Monica a key. Yeah, well, that's on you. Yeah, I know. If you want one, I would think about it. Well, if this is such... For today, yeah. I don't have a key to lock it. And yeah. We need a key to lock it. We need a key to lock it, yes. Okay. Well, she must. She must know that, so she'll she'll have to come back. Isn't 